During a press conference Tuesday, government official says China's first quarter industrial economy recovered steadily. According to the spokesperson of the Ministry of Industry and Information Technology, the added value of industrial enterprise above the designated size rose by 6.5 percent year-on-year, 2.6 percentage points higher than that of last quarter. In particular, the added value of the manufacturing industry grew by 6.2 percent year-on-year and accounted for 28.9 percent of the country's GDP, the highest since 2016. Despite this progress, officials warn that pressures remain, such as demand contractions, supply shocks, and lower expectations, affected by factors such as increased external variables, COVID-19 outbreaks, and weak demand recovery. Yet they still see potential and resilience in China's industrial development. The policies introduced since the fourth quarter last year for stabilizing industrial growth have continued to show their positive effects. The report on the work of the government plan to implement new tax reductions boost core competitiveness of manufacturing and expand domestic demand to release policy dividends at a faster speed. In response to challenges brought by the COVID outbreak in Shanghai, officials highlighted that China has pledged to safeguard its industrial and supply chains with a series of policies and measures to expedite recovery in the financial hub. We have implemented closed-loop management in industrial production and identified a list of key industries and enterprises engaged in foreign trade. To overcome logistical barriers and boost traffic flow, the country has issued sufficient travel permits that can be recognized across the nation. Despite temporary challenges, we are confident logistics will not be interrupted and determined to revive production. Meanwhile, officials also highlighted the achievements made in digital and green transformation and improvements in the information and communication technology industry.